Well, hi folks, I'm just on with a batch of these now. They're just simple sort of soup bowls, cereal bowls, but with a little bit of a sort of spout edge on them so you can rest your spoon in. It's just a bit of a design thing. They don't, it doesn't serve any purpose. So, I'll just get on and make a couple of those. Nothing very exciting, but uh, I'll show you how I make them. I've got about a pound and four ounces of clay, so not very big balls of clay. So I'm just going to centre it and then just go in, leaving the bed reasonably thick, about a third of an inch. I'm just going to lift it up, get a straight cylinder, like so. Lift up. I'm going to make a little bit of a ridge in it by stopping when I lift up like so and then just basically pinching in above and just going over like that which leaves a little bit of a ridge there. And to make the ball I'm just going to simply just flare it out from the inside out like so and then to accentuate this ridge I'm just going to push the ridge in like, like that and then above it, I'm just going to roll over the top, like so. Give a bit of a mop out. And then to put the little dimples in the, in the rim, I'm just going to use my middle finger and those two fingers like so. And just as you as you be putting a, like a spout in a jug, just do that, and then push out, and then match it up the other, the opposite side. Same thing, and you end up with something like that, which, like I say, it doesn't serve any purpose, but it's just quite a nice, easy design feature. So that's one. I'll just do another one quickly. About there, going above to form the lip, the ridge. Sorry, I'm just pushing a bit of the base and open it up. that little ridge technique and loads of different pots and it's quite effective it's gives them a little bit of detail so again just to make the spout like so pinch it in and just bend it over like so and there you go another one like that so that's it folks just a couple of simple soup bowls cereal bowls any sort of bowl you want with a little design edge on the rim that's it folks.